Hey golfers, here's another drill, the flamingo drill, on how to reduce that lower body slide and tighten up your golf swing. So let's get to work. Hey golfers, welcome to another episode of how to eliminate slack in your golf swing and generate that smooth power. So we've talked about the modified stance, working that. Let's say we want to make it a little bit more challenging. Well, we can go to that great flamingo drill that I released probably a long time ago now, probably like 15, almost 20 years ago. Uh, let's see, how old is Hannah Grace? Uh, she was one of my students that named it the Flamingo Drill, and she's now playing uh, golf up at Lee University. So yeah, it's, it's been a while. So Flamingo Drill, let's start the ball opposite the lead foot. Dial feet together, get yourself set up. And then you can kind of tweak this. Just go ahead and adjust and, and balance yourself so the, the trail foot is kind of just touching the ground. I don't want it up in the air, okay? And then now you can make your swing. Well, what happens if you get up to the top and you get over aggressive with your body, you're falling all over the place. That is an indicator that that lower body is running out. Arms can't catch up. It's going to be a nightmare. So, you can play around with it. If you want to modify it, you don't have to go all the way up. You can just go ahead and, and bring it down to here. The wide of the stance really doesn't do you a whole, good, a whole lot of good because why? You have a wide base of support. So, even though it's staggered, it's still the more you don't want to put it behind you because that's like near, I'd say, impossible. But if you think about it, this is like being. This time of year, especially it's cold here now in Oklahoma, uh, if you're on ice skates, you know, those thin blades, you're hitting a slap shot, you're on those thin blades, you can't get yourself going sideways. So this is, a, again, a great drill for you to create your speed. The better the arms work in the golf swing in transition, the better your balance is going to be. And you can still produce 85, 90% of your club head speed using the flamingo drill. So that's where we get that 15, 10 to 20 percent overall additional speed when we allow that body to go forward. But obviously with that drill, that's just drills just to work down to transition. It's not meant to be a cure-all, but it's just to work it from here, getting those arms down. Okay, by getting the arms down, now we can start delivering the body at the bottom of the swing where it becomes much more effective. So. For more information, head over to humo.golf. We go a little bit deeper into all the mechanics of the golf swing, but also simplifying the process so you can become a better golfer on the course, not just on the range. Talk to you all later. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you all later.